Right, so here we go, slightly new setup than um, what we normally used to. We have this lovely studio background built by um, Silent Fixit Ken. And uh, we're going to be looking at some mod model building. So today we've got the uh, Transformers Build Your Own 3D Puzzle. Includes 46 pieces and Build Your Own Bumblebee. Well, this is either going to go one or two ways really, so let's hope it goes the better way. Right, so looking at the box, we've got Build Your Own Bumblebee at the front, at the side, Autobot logo. Nothing on the bottom. Autobot logo. And nothing. And then we have basically what Build Your Own Bumblebee. It includes eight puzzle sheets, 46 pieces, an instruction leaflet, and a load of guff I can't really read. Um, because I'm looking through this, there's a camera lens. So... We're just generally going to have a laugh and uh, try and uh, put some of this together. Now this, I've had this for absolutely donkey's years, to tell you the truth, and I've never actually looked at it. So, this is going to be a first. Right. So we're going to put that over there. And we're just generally, um, I mean, things are getting uh, quite freaky with this... Um, virus stuff kicking around so I figured we should all need a laugh warning don't put this bag it is not what, what does that say hang on warning this bag is not a toy to avoid danger and suffocation keep out reach of babies and children well I would assume you would not give this to your fucking child so why would you give this to your child it's just it's just path really isn't it fucking hell yeah, we're just generally going to have a laugh today uh, and a basic muck around because I can't think of anything else to do in these dark times. So we're just going to tell some jokes, have a laugh, and we should all be good. Right, so, um, shit. All seems pretty straight for A, B, C. D, E. What have we got? Let's have a look. I'm assuming that's B. Looks like a B. Now it's for... And six. What the flying fuck is going on here? Two. Three, six, six, five. Well, this complicates matters straight away. Okay, right, so assuming that A is pieces twenty two. So we're at 25, 31, 36, 32 and 33. So I want 22, 30, 27 and 28. That's for A, all right. All right, so you're the nightmare sheet. I'll stick you there. Because no one wants to know you, son. Right, you are sheet. Jesus knows, you can go over there. I want the one with 22 on it. The sheet with 22 on it. You are my golden lottery ticket, kid. 24, 23, 22. Now, this is all just going to be a lot of bollocks, eh? Because here's 22. Then I'm going to have to find 27. And just generally muck it all around. Oh, for... Christ, all right, okay. So, we're going to start with 22, which is this part here. This here is 22. All right. <clears throat> 22. You can't see there, but there's a shelf up there. Right, so you can go over there, and I want number three. 30 which is here that's on the nightmare sheet right 30 
22 and 30 are both out. 30. 22, this is going to take a fucking age. Right, so fold everything in. Like it says. One assumes. I assume I don't need them. I don't know, I probably do, but right, fuck it. We're winging it. Right, so we've got 30. And 30 goes there. And there. In these little patches here. Uh, 22 sort of folds over and smacks them two bad boys out there. Brick straight forward and stick him up the top there where the uh, little shelf in question is. There's a little bumblebee body. Right, right, so then we need. What the f twenty eight and twenty seven? I'll clicks into them bits there, right? Okay, so twenty eight, twenty seven. As luck would have it, they're on the main sheet here, All right? Twenty six. 27 and 28. Well, it was 27 and 28, wasn't it? I ain't to dicking around here, am I? No. Right, yeah, I kind of, kind of fudge that one up a bit. Ain't gonna worry about it though, because it all looks quite good from there. Okay, now corner this. Right, thirty smacks into them two side panels there. Twenty-seven and twenty-eight smack into these little holes here. And by the look of it, everyone should be happy like that. I don't know. We'll deal with it as we get to it. Right, so do it, but, but screw it, that's close enough. Right, so now we want. What the fuck's that? Oh, B starts from B starts from this side, right? So we want thirty-one the largest, most complicated part. I'm not even sure if half these parts are Right, you see, I thought to myself, oh, you know, I'll do this, I'll do this old, uh, this model uh, building malarkey, and I'll, I'll tell some jokes as I go along, because I'll tell some jokes and make everyone happy and make everyone laugh and all smiley and stuff, and they'll be like, wee, what an absolute legend this is to watch, and it turns out, it's turned to be a bit of a, a bit of a nightmare. So now, for the duration, I don't think I'll be telling jokes and whatever. Because it just don't seem to be the case. Right, so that goes there. These come here, and it looks like this. For some strange reason is telling me 
got that. They should all fit together. Is that what you're telling me? You random piece of garbage. Oh right, you got you fold. You fold. Right, okay. So you folded pieces fit in there like that. Get in. Yes you do. Right. Now I'm starting to like you a bit better than what I did before. Okay. Alright, so you fold like that. Circular pokey holes, which I've probably um kicked out the joint by now. Um boof. Okay, right, so none of this seems to be fitting together at this well obviously you guys probably fit in there, it's making more solid, I would have thought. Do you? Please do. I don't want to break it. I'm pretty sure this was a Christmas present. Yep, yeah, that's looking all autobotish and bumblebeeish. We'll leave that be as it is. Right, so we're going to um, go with 37s and 36s to make that joint piece there. Right, so when I've been mucking around, has anyone seen 37s and 36s? they're not on the nightmare sheet anyway all right 37s and 36s well then them little um i need them i know i need them i've seen them oh shit oh fuck them right um 37s anyone ah 37, 36, nice to meet you, to, see, to meet you, nice, and that means that you are the evil counterpart, ah, 37, 36, get here you sexy little bastards, right, uh, I'll throw the other nightmare shoes over there because no one wants to see it, right, so, 24s, go inside the body so they go in there all right 36 attaches to 37 like so i'll do that with the other one like so like little evil deviants of doom Right, so they go inside there. So where is the bits that I... There you go, 24s. Just bodge the hole in it there. Where's the other one? Shit. Oh, here we go. That'll do. Oh, come on, you... I'm pretty sure there's an age rating on this thing. <clears throat> And I'm pretty sure that most of the age ratings on these lie. Because it'll say, don't let your child of, you know, six play with this thing. Because it's um, some enchantment for the fucking devil. What makes it worse is I plan to do more of these videos in the future. And I thought, oh, to, to break myself in it, to, um, to make it so it's a bit more... Um, better for me you know i'll do something a lot less um taxing something something really easy that i can get into right let's put that up there on that shelf Got quite a little bumblebee thing going on here anyway. and then um after after that then i can just generally what do i need now 42 and uh, I've, I've lost myself mid rant here because I'm after little tiny shitty little car parts. I thought, ah, oh, you know, I'll do this just to generally break me in so I don't have to um, worry about anything, you know. And then if this takes off, then I'll start doing um, some building videos. I've got quite a few build kits upstairs. 
then as it turns out, these things are actually spawned by Satan himself. And they're quite difficult to do. Right, so where's 39? And 42. Here's 42. Little bastard. And here's 39 right in front of me. Nice. Oh, we're racking through these parts like no one's business here. This shouldn't actually be too much of a bother. Right, so according to this, all right. Bend them in half and shove them in. In that general direction, which ain't too much of a hardship. All I gotta do is poke the little panels out here. I hope. Does it matter? Is it? Yes, it does actually matter. Because the cardboard's bent in such a peculiar way that it can only be done in one fucking shape, so you've actually got to watch out. What? Ah, right, and make sure you their face like that because that's going to attach to the little <clears throat> you're poking poke yourself in you little shit it's not in it's not even getting there because I've got this little tiny wedge of polystyrene doom in the fucking way. Right. Oh now I've just dropped most of this shit on the floor because it's fallen off the table. Right, you get out, you little bastard, right? You get in there. All is good in the world. That fell out. That little tiny piece of shit fell out. <clears throat> you get in there. We have some remnants of Bumblebee's arm. Fantastic. That took more effort than it was possibly physically worth. And now. I've learned a very valuable lesson, not to use a butter knife to poke these fucking parts through. Because whatever stupid company made this fucking model kit in the first place didn't do a very good job of doing it. Because half the, the stuff comes off when you're doing it. Right. So, fine. Now that's come undone. Fantastic. And I tell you what, this is why people go on serial killer rampages and completely annihilate everything in their path. They've obviously been given one of these for Christmas and they've thought, you know what, fuck the world. No one cares. With my hardships and troubles, all I want to do is build a nice little model kit. And instead, I've got shit flying around everywhere. Right. So there we go. We've got two alarms. That can sit up there. Right. So there you go. Price point of the uh, the future. There we've got two bits of bumblebee. And I seem to have a load of stuff kicking around. Right, so we had a brief time lapse there because I had to go and sort the dogs out. So after the brief time lapse, we are now back. And we are now recording again. So from what, what happens now is basically this part of Bumblebee, the one that we constructed, the one that took a fucking nightmare to do, according to the instructions, 
has to attach to the part that we built earlier on. So it seems to attach, I want to say, um, the only way it does look like it can attach because these instructions are the worst instructions known to man is at the back of the body that bit so the three pins at the very top so this sort of goes so the the feet pegs are, are sticking out the other way so that looks like it does that in some weird sort of thing maybe I hope which means they should fit all flush like so or maybe not. Right, so that's done like that. Well, if that's a, the first part of Bumblebee, it seems to have gone together all right, really. I mean, it's where it is. I mean, the mountain type looks like a big piece of shit, but fair play. Fair enough, fair enough. We'll go with that. Right, so I think this is actually going to be a two-parter, if I'm honest with you, because this is taking way longer than I expected it to. So, let's just have a quick look at um, C. Oh, we've got CD in it. Oh my fuck, have you seen how much I've got to do to C? The hell is all this shit? So I've got to construct the head, put the arms on, and then the rest of the steps of the legs. And the body's just falling everywhere. Right, okay. I mean, that's a... Oh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck have I got myself into here? Right, so, okay, positive notes. So, on the first positive outlook, if you need something to do when you're shut down, stuck, because there's a killer virus on the fucking loose, um, these type of things are, are good to take your mind off things, but on the other hand, they frustrate the living fuck out of you. I would not, um, when you're about to lose your shit, um spend any copious amount of time trying to uh, you know if you're bored you've got nothing to do fair enough however if you literally let's just arrange my camera here so you can see the fruits of our labor there you go it's took me all this time just to do that right let me just have a look at the box let me just show you the box here it says on the box warning Choking hazard. Not suitable for children under 36 months. 36 months due to small parts. Recommended for ages 6 plus. 6 plus. Who the fuck made this? Paladon. Right. Paladone, you obviously don't know jack shit because a child of six plus, namely a six year old, would not be able to fucking do it. And as for not suitable for children under 36 months, fucking hell, it's not suitable for someone of my age. I'm near enough fucking 40. Okay, right, so what we're going to do, we're going to end this on the part one, we're going to end on a joke. Let's just glory fucking Bumblebee a bit more, right? So, the joke of the evening. Bill Clinton 
and Tiger Woods, they're on a golf course somewhere, and they're playing around the golf. And after the, the 18th hole, they've had enough of golf, the golf game's finished, and they go to um, the bathroom. And they're there in the cubicles and the urinals just having a, a random piss. And Bill Clinton looks at Tiger Woods's cock and he went, Oh my God, he says, Tiger, he says, you've got such quite a big thick cock. He says, how did your cock get that big and thick? And Tiger goes, well, Bill, what I did is every evening I take my cock and I uh, smash it three times up against the bed frame. And Bill goes, really, Tiger? And Tiger was like, yeah, Bill, that's what I do every evening. I take my cock out and smash it three times up against the bed frame. And um, as soon as I've done that, you know, I will have a thicker cock. If you do this, Bill, you too will also have a thicker cock. And Bill's like, oh, oh, thanks, Tiger. So that evening, Bill Clinton goes up to the bedroom, undresses, straight into the bedroom, whaps his cock out, bangs it, bang, 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 three times up the bedpost. And at that point, Hillary jumps out of bed and goes, Tiger, is that you? Boom. Right, so... That was part one of the most um, horrendous 